What's up YouTube, Jeff back again today with a very exciting tech video for you guys. And if you're paying for cloud storage, you've probably noticed one thing, whether it's Google Drive, iCloud, Dropbox, Box, it doesn't matter. You're probably paying a lot of money every month. Today, I'm gonna to tell you guys a better solution for this, which is the Ugreen DH2300 two bay NAS, which is essentially your own private cloud that you fully own. You do not need to pay a monthly subscription for it. And it's better for uploading your project files, your home movies, your photos, just about everything that you need on a daily basis. Now, I've personally switched over. I've been using a NAS for my business for the last few years, and now I've switched over our home network and storage to the Ugreen NAS after this review. Today, I'm gonna to break it down into five reasons why you might wanna consider switching from traditional cloud storage paying monthly to something like the Ugreen DH2300. So let's jump right into it. Let's take a quick look at what you get in the box with the Ugreen DH2300. You are going to find the NAS unit itself, which has a cover there, which you'll open up and you'll reveal the two bays to insert your hard drives. You're also going to get some screws to place the 2.5 or 3.5 hard drives that you purchase or you already have that you're going to insert. You also get a little magnetic screwdriver to secure those into place, and it's very easy to do so. I'll show you guys a clip of that in just a second. Uh, in addition, of course, you're gonna get your power cable and also the cable to hook up your ethernet so you can plug that directly, attach it directly to your modem, which is the idea with NAS, which stands for Network Attached Storage, of course. And as I said, it's very simple to set up and install the drives. All you have to do is get your drive of choice. Like I said before, Ugreen sent me out two four terabyte drives to install here. Just take the proper screws, fix them in place right there, and it takes less than a minute to install the drives, pop back on the cover, and then you're ready to jump into the setup. The setup is equally simple. You can download the Ugreen app. You can also scan the QR code there on the NAS itself. You'll be able to get right in there and set it up once it is plugged into your router or your modem, and you're really good to go in about two minutes with the setup. So the unboxing experience, installing the drive setup, probably five minutes or so if you're a pretty savvy tech user. It's very simple to do, but even if you're brand new to NAS, this isn't gonna take you more than 10 minutes. Cloud storage really does seem cheap, but that is until you break down those monthly costs. Whether you're paying for one terabyte, two terabytes, five terabytes, you're probably paying 10, 20, maybe even $30 a month to get those storage benefits with Google Drive or iCloud or Dropbox. Now, that doesn't seem like a lot per month, but over time, $300 a year times 10 years, you've paid $3,000 just to store your own files, which is very disappointing and very expensive. The NAS, like the Ugreen DH2300, you do one purchase up front of the NAS itself and two additional drives, which you put in these two bays, and it can hold up to 60 terabytes, which is likely enough to hold all of your movies, all of your photos, and even your project files for a YouTube creator like myself, who uploads a lot of video files to my NAS to retrieve later and also pass along to my editor. Once you do buy the NAS plus the two drives, you get unlimited storage, no upsells, no monthly subscriptions, and you fully own the data that you store on the NAS. Now, Ugreen has a variety of different drives, different manufacturers that are supported for the DH2300. I'm showing you guys there on the screen a list, but it's very expansive. You'll have no problem finding a two couple drives that will fit inside of this NAS. And if you have a couple of spare hard drives lying around that are supported, this supports both 2.5 and 3.5 inch hard drives, so you'll have no problem finding something that can go inside. When you store your data on cloud services like Google Drive or iCloud, you're also giving them the ability to scan your files. You could also have various data breaches that as we've seen many times over the last several years do occur. And so it really isn't the most secure solution for storing your personal family data or entertainment. With the Ugreen NAS, your data lives on your own drives. So you're not agreeing to anyone else's security policies. You don't have to worry about external data breaches and you also have access to your files at any time that you want. Plus the Ugreen DH2300 supports RAID configurations. And with something like RAID 1, you'll be able to get data redundancy. That means that if one of the drives fails, all of your data is automatically mirrored on the other drive so that you have an automatic backup. This is actually one of the best features of NAS in general because you do not have this sort of thing going on with cloud storage. You're automatically getting a backup. Now, of course, that does half your storage. If you have, say, two four terabyte drives like Ugreen sent out to me for testing, you're only gonna have four terabytes of usable space. 
because you're always mirroring your data on that other drive for the backup. So I do recommend making sure that you buy a single capacity, say if you need 10 terabytes, buy two 10 terabyte drives. So in that case, you get that RAID redundancy. And you get amazing features with the Ugreen NAS. A couple of features I wanna mention, and then I'll walk you guys through all of the apps that come with the Ugreen software interface for this NAS. The first one that's really cool is that you can back up your Mac's time machine automatically just by changing a couple settings inside the Ugreen software interface, which works on both Windows, Mac, Android, and iOS. You can also do photo backup on your iPhone, automatically back up all of your phone photos that you take with your iPhone to your Ugreen NAS, which is a great feature. This makes sure that you don't lose any data on your Mac or photos from your iPhone. You can also back up your Android photos as well, or your entire Android phone and your Windows PC. All of those things are supported and they all happen seamlessly, which is one of the best features of Ugreen or any other NAS out there. And it really gives you a huge advantage over cloud storage. Let's take a look at some of the other awesome features that you can get with the apps inside of the Ugreen software. In terms of useful apps, you do get the file section and a control panel, which also has full user management. You can add and also change permissions for users, make them an administrator, for instance, for your significant other. You get a backup section where you can back up all of your phones, your computers. You also have photos and a place to manage your movies, which is the theater app. And those both work great for viewing all of your media that you have at home. You can also use that on your TV if you play over HDMI directly. And of course you have a security scan so you can make sure to keep your NAS secure at all times. In addition to all of those amazing apps that come with the Ugreen software platform for the NAS, you also have multi-user accounts and also NFC tap to access. This means that you can set up the NAS for use with all of your family members, including your kids and teens, your significant other, and you can give custom permissions for each user so that each user gets exactly what they need. This way you can share files, you can share entertainment, you can also password protect files that are important for your work if you don't want other people to have access to those. And with the NFC single tap to log in, just tap your phone to the NAS right there and you'll be able to get in and get access to all of your files. When it comes to convenience and on-the-go access, the Ugreen support is amazing as well. You can access all of your files remotely easily using the Ugreen app for your NAS. You can do this using Android and iOS and also your Windows and Mac computer. So you do not have to be on the same Wi-Fi network that your NAS is attached to. You don't have to worry about any of that. You'll be able to quickly get in and get access to your files if you need to download a quick file for work. I often need to do this for creative projects. In addition, you can share various folders, and I do this with my video editor. He all needs access to all of my project files so that he can perform edits on the various projects we're working on. Instead of sharing a folder on something like Google Drive, I can share him a folder on my NAS, and then he'll be able to get access to that as well if I designate remote access. The other awesome convenient feature, and when it comes to entertainment for your family, is that you can use this to play movies on any TV in your home. It even has a direct HDMI connection that allows 4K streaming directly from the NAS, so you can just move it to your TV, by your TV, plug it in using the HDMI, and stream those very quickly. You can also use this as a Plex server, which is a compelling option if you already use Plex. Store all of your movies on this Ugreen NAS and then be able to stream them to any TV, laptop, phone, tablet that you own. Both of these are great, but Ugreen also supplies the option to get media directly from their software as well. So if you don't use Plex, it's easy to manage your media collection inside of the Ugreen UI. The final huge selling point is speed. And speed is important when you're uploading, for instance, large files. Like I said, as a creator, I'm often uploading very large video files for my projects to these shared folders that I then share with my editor. I was doing some testing here while I was reviewing this new game DH2300. And I noticed that when you upload to the NAS at home, you will automatically see a two to five times speed increase over uploading to something like Google Drive, which was my previous cloud storage of choice. And that probably holds true for iCloud and Dropbox as well. So not only are you getting a cheaper overall solution, you purchase the NAS, which right now is priced amazingly. I'll tell you guys more about that. It's under $200 with the discount, plus a couple of drives. You're looking at maybe $400 of upfront cost versus something like those cloud storages where you're gonna pay $300 a year maybe versus 400 one time, saving a ton of money getting a ton of great features, privacy and security, 
entertainment for the whole family, convenience on the go, and you get this huge speed bump, there's really no reason not to go with the Ugreen DH2300. At this price point, it is easily the best entry-level NAS for people who are looking to get into NAS, but they didn't think that maybe they could set it up or they thought it was too complicated or too expensive. None of those things are true with the Ugreen DH2300. And we fully migrated over from Google Drive and are enjoying the freedom of not paying that monthly subscription fee and having access to all of our files. So if you're also tired of paying those monthly subscription fees and wanna have full access to your data on a private and secure NAS like the Ugreen DH2300, check the link in the description in the pinned comment to get 20% off now. This is not gonna last long, so make sure you guys take advantage of it today. Appreciate you guys checking out this video. Appreciate Ugreen for sending out this NAS and these two drives for the review. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.